it is your girl treasure release and i am back with another video this night i decided to stay at my grandmother's house and the thing is she lives a little bit further than what i do in orlando so i'm on my way to the airport right now um she's about 40 minutes away from the airport and i'm about 20 minutes away from the airport so there's a big difference how much time you know I had to leave and everything but I'm about 25 minutes away from the airport right now this is gonna be a four-day trip for me so I have um, just one leg today thank God um, and I am staying in st. Louis Missouri tonight I know I've been there before but I really don't remember um, the layover guys look at the sky the sky is beautiful by the way the sky looks so pretty. So yeah, I am gonna be working the seat position today. So, well not today, but the entire trip. Um, so I'm gonna be in the front of the plane. I'm super excited because I haven't been the seat in forever. So this should be very interesting. I've been off for about four days now. So I'm ready to get back to work, make a new flight attendant chronicles for you guys. And I'm hoping and praying that this trip goes as smooth as possible. Hey guys, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get off of this camera. Pay attention to the road because the sun is like doing what it wants to do right now. And we are boarding. So I am officially on the plane now. Um, we were delayed by like an hour. I am changing my shoes, putting my flats on guys, because my feet are killing me. My heels hurt my feet so bad, but um, our flight time is only two hours and five minutes and we are oversewed by six. So hopefully everybody somehow gets a seat. Uh, but yes, I'm gonna go ahead and check all of my seats, make sure everything is good to go. Um, we have to board very quickly. So I will see you guys once we land in St. Louis. Bye. All right, beautiful people. So we landed in Missouri. The flight went really, really good. Um, we're still on the plane, just waiting for some last minute um, flight attendants to go ahead and get their bags. So we're gonna head over to the hotel. And I really don't remember if I've been to this hotel before, but I am kind of excited. It's, I think like 9, 30, 10 o'clock here. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut off the camera now. Um, it's raining outside. It's very, very cold. So I'm gonna shut it off and I will catch you guys once we check in at the hotel. Bye. Mm, it's so long. Hello, hello, beautiful people. So your girl, Chaz Release, made it to the hotel here in St. Louis. Um, so I already ran downstairs, got my dinner. I ate a little bit downstairs. Um, only because I only had like a quick hour to get food. Anyways, I'm gonna do a quick tour. Now I've been in a room, I changed my clothes, I just got out of the shower, so please excuse my towel and toiletries that's sitting on the sink. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour. Here in St. Louis, we are actually one hour behind Orlando. Um, so it's 12.40 here. So Orlando, it will be, I believe, 1.40 a.m., something around that time. Um, my shuttle doesn't come until tomorrow, and I think 3.30 p.m. I need to call downstairs to the front desk and figure out the exact time. Um, like I said, I think, it, I think it's 1.30, but I need to make sure for sure. Um, so I have not left. Um, so I started watching this new TV show called The Blacklist, so I'm gonna go ahead and watch that because it's so freaking good. I'm loving it so far, so I'm gonna go ahead and watch that and try to down half of this bottle before I go to bed. That's my goal usually when I'm at hotels. I'm not a big fan of Dasani because it has so many minerals and chloride and all the extra mist inside of it. Um, but I'm gonna try to down one of those as I watch Blacklist. And yeah, I'm just gonna head to bed now. So I'm gonna close out the vlog for today. 
so I will be checking in some time tomorrow. So friends, if you are new to this channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe, um, like, comment down below any questions that you may have, and thank you so, so, so much for supporting and tuning in to another Flight Attendant Chronicles, guys. All right, I'm hitting the bed now. Good night. Hello, hello, beautiful people. So, um, my layover here in Missouri is coming to an end. I am sleepy. I did not get good sleep in this room at all last night. Um, I don't think I'm a fan of this hotel because they put me in a really weird area and I was just having nightmares all night. I'm 20 something years old. Why in the world am I still having nightmares? I don't know. Um, but yeah guys, it was just really, really weird vibes here. I'm just ready to go. Like. I'm ready to go. I'm going to take a earlier um, airport shuttle. They said that they do run every 15 minutes. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get dressed right now. And yeah, just leave here I think like 30 minutes early. I also want to get food. But guys, I didn't have the greatest experience in this room at all. I don't know why. I don't know if it's something I ate too late or I don't know. I don't know. I'm ready to go, so I'm gonna get dressed and head downstairs. The shuttle that I'm taking should be here in about 15, 20 minutes. Um, so yeah, I'll come back to you guys once I am fully dressed. Bye. Hmm. Out of here. <clears throat> so cold here, guys, but. I know it's gonna be even more colder in Denver. Well, okay, so we made it onto the plane now. The first leg that we have from, where am I right now? Where are we? St. Louis. St. Louis to Las Vegas will be three hours and five minutes. Um, I think we are completely full, just how we were yesterday coming in. It's a little cloudy, it's so cold as heck, but um, I'm just ready to, Get to Denver tonight so I can relax and finally get some real rest. Um, because like I said, that hotel was weird. Um, but yeah, I stopped by Chili's and I got me some grilled chicken with some rice and beans. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish eating that because I checked all of my equipment. Um, but we will be leaving soon. Our equipment is good. So, uh, do you have a good um, amount of water up there? I will come to you guys once we land in Denver. Alright guys, bye. So, I am in the hotel here in Denver. Um, you guys, if you are a true subscriber, you watch my videos, you guys have seen this room here plenty of times. Um, it's the next day and my bed is looking a mess, so I'm not going to do a tour this time around. But it is about, guys, yeah, so it's 1 o'clock now. Um, my shuttle doesn't come for another hour, it comes at 2 o'clock. So I'm craving a chicken Caesar salad, so I think I'm going to run across the street because um, they have like this pizza place and they have like really good salads. So I'm going to go over there, grab me lunch, I have not eaten yet. I'm getting sick here in Denver, like not sick sick, but my nose is stuffy, it's running, I've been sneezing. So I'm going to go ahead and take some cold medicine. It was 23 degrees yesterday. So it's very cold for me because you know I live in Florida where it's like 80, 90 degrees and for me to come jump straight into 20 degree weather, my body and my skin is so dried and yeah, so I'm just going to take some medicine. Um, we have two flights today. It is a very, very quick day. I'm speaking into existence. Everything is going to go well. Um, we go to Kansas City, Missouri, and then we come right back here to Denver. So the flights are blocked at one hour and 38 minutes. So it's probably going to be like maybe like 1:15. So very very quick flight. All right, guys. So I made it onto the plane here in Denver. Um, we are heading to Kansas City soon. We are actually on an Airbus 319. I have not been on any of these planes. In months it's been so long but this is gonna be a very easy quick day um, I believe that we are full pilots just literally got on the plane um, so of course we don't have any paperwork yet. made it to Denver oh, and it's freezing cold oh god With the engine Hey guys, 
guys, so I actually made it here to the room um, in Denver. This is so freaking cute. I love it. It's my first time here at this hotel as well. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys a quick little tour so you can see how adorable this room is. Why? Because today is freaking go home day. I'm so excited <laughs> to go home. Tomorrow is Thanksgiving and I am off. I'm just so ready to spend it with my family um, and friends. I probably won't be with any friends, but to spend it with my family. Super excited. My layover here in uh, Denver in this hotel was awesome because guys, this bed was so lit. Like, this bed was so freaking um, comfortable. I have to tell you guys something, but my shuttle's gonna be here in 10 minutes and I need to hurry up and get down the stairs. And I kinda wanted to wait till the end of my trip to tell you because I didn't wanna kinda like spook my own self out because I knew I had to stay in more hotels. But guys, let's just say I'm not trying to go back to St. Louis at all, ever again in that hotel. Bad, bad, bad vibes scary vibes to the point where I wanted to just cry. Never ever experienced anything like that before. Oh my god, look how beautiful it is outside. That skyline is so gorgeous. It's a beautiful outside. And that's the pool down there. So yeah, it's so dark here. Thank God I woke up when I did and I have enough time to kind of get my life together. I listen to some classical music, so I'm feeling really good. Um, and it's go home day. Uh, but yeah, guys, I'll tell you the story a little bit later because I don't have time now just because the shadow's gonna be here instantly, but this was a trip that I'm not feeling at all. Plus, the pressure here is making my head hurt so bad and my jaw, I'm just like not feeling good. Hey guys, okay, so I totally forgot to close out the last vlog, so I'm gonna go ahead and close that out right now. Um, but basically, the thing I had to tell you was the last hotel that I was in um, was in St. Louis. I've never been inside like a haunted hotel or a haunted house or anything crazy like that. Me personally, I don't play with stuff like that. I'm not a fan of it. Um, I went to sleep peacefully. I don't want people talking to me in my sleep and all the weird different things. Um, but that's exactly what I experienced when I was in St. Louis and it was not a good experience. I kind of went down to the front desk to ask them if they can move my room. Um, unfortunately, since I was checking out that day, they couldn't move my room. So I hadn't gotten any sleep when I was there. And I thought maybe it was just me. I thought maybe like, like I said before, it was something that I ate or like I watched something, but that's the thing, I didn't do anything out of the ordinary of my regular night routine. Um, and what's so crazy is that the next day, once I got back on the plane, I was explaining to the flight attendants like, please excuse me if I seem a little drowsy or just tired. He was basically explaining to me that I am not the only one that's experienced like weird things happening in that hotel and even where they placed my room was in such a weird area i was not having it so from now on i'm going to try my best to remember um to put no st louis trips on my schedule um when i'm bidding for my schedule and everything because it wasn't a good experience at all i was having very bad nightmares 
when I never, ever, ever have bad nightmares. Like, it's been times where, like, I have weird dreams, but not bad nightmares. So, yes, that is what happens there. I don't want to get too in depth in it because, once again, I'm in another hotel and I need to sleep tonight. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this vlog up now. So, thank you so much for watching this entire video. Um, if you are new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And also, like, if you guys want to see anything in particular, please comment down below for any video suggestions because I know it's probably getting old just me doing my regular vlogs you know from at work but if you have any other video suggestions please dm me um private message me or even comment down below and i will be sure to put those videos out for you guys um but yes i'm gonna go ahead and eat my dinner my frozen meal and uh, i will see you guys next time bye